Welcome to the Full Tactical Range by Range Systems. I'm Bo Dobozinski, lead instructor for Sealed Mindset Training, and this is your Rifle Drill of the Week. This week, we're gonna build on what we learned last week with hold sights but we're gonna add in a focus on something called mounting. Mounting is the process of taking the rifle from any of your ready positions up to your line of sight in order to have sight alignment and put rounds downrange. Now, generally speaking, we work with something called the two hands high position. In the home defense, the two hands high position is here. So I've got both hands on my vertical foregrip and my pistol grip. I've got uh, everything wrapped in, I'm tucked in, I'm very, very tight. It's very, very tight and controlled to me. The muzzle is actually in line with my eye. So right over the top of my eyeball is where I'm looking at my, uh, my target. Now, everywhere I move, now the muzzle kind of comes with me at this sort of eyeball uh, position. This uh, spot for us is a really, really powerful position. It's in essence, you, you've got this sort of um, guarded position, just like if you were coming and doing uh, a fist fight. All I'm doing now is instead of having my, my fists like this, I'm just putting the rifle in that same spot as I would have had my, my fists for the fight. And so if for some reason a threat comes really, really close and tries to grab us, that's okay. This is a very strong position. We can start fighting. And if I need to, I can muzzle strike and do other kinds of horrible things to people from that spot. Mounting from this position is also very efficient. Uh, from this position, I've got a lot of big muscles that are involved in moving this rifle up into position versus if I set up real low, I really am just lifting with a shoulder on the one side. So I'm very dependent on what's happening uh, support side of the body. Just not quite as efficient uh, musculature wise to be able to mount. When we go to mount, what we're looking to do is we're looking to punch the muzzle forward like I'm gonna punch the guy with the muzzle right in the face. And as I'm punching the muzzle out, I'm gonna go just far enough that the stock clears my body or all of my kit. Once I'm clear of all of that, now I'm gonna rotate the rifle. So I'm rotating it in two ways. I'm pulling down and pushing out with the support hand, and I'm pulling backwards and lifting up with the primary hand. So both hands are rotating at the exact same time. And if this pop is done just right, that uh, stock should sit just up underneath the clavicle, right with cheek, cheek weld alignment, and you should be able to get rounds on target very rapidly. If I do this right, what ends up happening is, is that I will actually touch myself and jaw with my spot. So it'll hit me just a little bit, and I'll be in alignment as soon as it does. We're gonna do a three-tier drill set based on just that mounting work. So the first one, we're just gonna work through the position very nice and easy. So we'll set ourselves up somewhere between 15 and 20 feet of our target. Again, we're thinking house defense range is very close. Remember what your hold of sights is for that kind of distance. So we can put the round exactly where we want it, not low or high or anything like that. It goes exactly where we want it. From there, we'll go and do a nice steady position, good slow mount, set our position, make sure that our weapon moved to fire as soon as the stock hits the shoulder. Get a shot down range, reset assess, and 360 check. Mount the weapon. One shot. Reset. Assess. 360 check. Same thing. Drill number two, we're gonna work that same deal, but now what we're gonna do is we're gonna add uh, time crunch. So we'll set ourselves up in our ready position. We're all ready to go. Shot timer buzzer will go off. Good mount, nice and fast. Get up in position, rip the gun apart. One shot, reset, assess, and 360 check. For drill number three, we're gonna add in exactly the same material that we were working on in last week's drill of the week, namely the uh, hold of sights adjustment. So we're gonna work at the 10 foot, 20 foot, and 30 foot levels. So again, probably some of the biggest spaces in most people's homes, between 30 and 40 feet. And we're gonna do that same work now with our shot timer at each of those positions. So buzzer goes off, mount, bang, reset, assess, and 360 check. Move back to the next space, do it again. Move back to the next space, do it again. Uh, every time here, the goal is just to be a uh, very consistent time-wise for any of those shots inside of your home defense range distances.
Working a good solid defensive mount is critical for us as home defenders. Remember that defensive mount has to be able to work for us regardless of the distance of the threat to us. And it also has to be ready so that we can start to fight the threat using this as our defensive tool if for some reason we don't have the ability to shoot it. Now forget the idea that this is a shooting tool, this is a defensive tool. That means if it doesn't work shooting, it's still effective as an impact weapon as an example. Having a good uh, ready position and a mount to utilize this as the impact weapon will benefit you greatly. And then finally, we should be able to do that mount with lots of speed and precision at any range available to us that would be we would see inside of our homes. So work these drills, develop your good defensive mount, and we'll see you in the next Rifle Drill of the Week. Like what you saw? Subscribe to my YouTube channel and keep checking out the training blog for more tips and drills. If you'd like a PDF copy of this training drill, Go to SealMindsetTraining.com and to the PDF download section. There, type in the promo code, Rifle Drill, number two.